The documents, which U.S. media have uploaded online, list asset values within a range, rather than giving precise figures. President Trump's daughter Ika and her husband, Jared Kushner, have assets valued between $240 million and $740 million, pound 191 m 590 million pounds. That includes a stake in Trump International Hotel, which earned M's Trump between $1 million and $5 million last year. The financial disclosure documents also detail salaries of several other high-profile figures in the administration. Ethics regulations require such financial disclosures for staff working in the White House. The documents show income and assets at the time they started working for the U.S. government, before any assets were sold or disposed of. Ivka Trump's business empire is worth more than $50 million, and the value of her stake in Trump International Hotel is between $5 million and $25 million, according to the filing of her husband, Jared. Ms. Trump only recently became a formal White House employee, and may file her own disclosure form later. Jared Kushner's disclosure document runs to 54 pages, detailing positions held at 267 organizations, many of which he has since divested himself of. In the previous year, he earned hundreds of thousands of dollars from real estate and other assets. Steve Bannon, now a senior White House advisor, was paid $191,000 in consulting fees by conservative media outlet Breitbart, in addition to at least $1 million in other employment income. He also had between $3.3 million and $12.6 million in assets. Sean Spicer, the White House press secretary, was paid $260,000 for his role as chief strategist and communications director at the Republican National Committee, and holds several real estate assets. Kellyanne Conway, Trump's campaign chief turned advisor, earned more than $800,000, mostly for consulting services, including Mr. Trump's campaign. Gary Cohn, head of the White House National Economic Council and a former Goldman Sachs president, has assets worth at least $230 million, but potentially more, as many of his assets are simply listed as worth over $1 million. The White House said Mr. Cohn resigned from all his positions at Goldman Sachs. White House Chief of Staff Rians Priebus had assets of between $604,000 and $1.16 million and income of $1.42 million. About $566,000 of his income came from the Republican National Committee and the rest from his partnership in a Milwaukee law firm. These are incredibly successful individuals, very high net worth, very sophisticated, complex asset structures, numerous sub-LLCs, limited liability companies, trusts and other items, all of which have to be worked through, the White House official said, adding that every staff member had a sit-down about their assets. Trump this week officially added his daughter Ivka to his staff. She had a fashion business and was involved in her father's global real estate development business, but stepped aside from managing the businesses when her father entered the White House.